again, my name is Gabe Zolna. This is the 10th of February, 2019. Article was posted on the 8th of February by BuzzFeed News, written by Amber Jameson. That's J-A-M-I-E-S-O-N. Title, Five Kids Aged 12 to 16 Have Been Charged with Killing the Lead Singer of a Nashville Rock Band. Police say the children shot and killed Kyle Yorletz, the lead singer in the rock band Carvatron, after he refused to give them the keys to his car. National police officers have charged five children with criminal homicide following the shooting of 24-year-old musician outside his home on Thursday. Police say the children shot and killed Kyle Yorletz, the lead singer, in the rock band Carvatron after he refused to give them the keys to his car. They had already stolen his wallets. The children, three girls and two boys, aged 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16, have been charged as a juvenile with homicide. Police say that the five kids were driving in a stolen red Chevrolet Colorado pickup truck in the alley behind Rolette's home in the College Heights Clifton neighborhood. Yorlet was outside his house when the children spoke with him, stole his wallet, and demanded that he give them the keys to his vehicle. When he refused, he was shot, said police. The Belmont University graduate made it back inside the house, where a housemate found him. He was taken to Vanderbilt University Medical Center, where he was pronounced dead, according to the police. On Thursday evening, police traced the stolen pickup truck to West Nashville Walmart, where all five children were arrested. They had a stolen loaded 9mm pistol, and a second stolen gun was found inside the store. Yorlet's Carbaton bandmates released a statement on Facebook about the singer's death. On February the 7th, 2019, we lost our brother, best friend, and bandmate, Carl Yorlet's. We are in a state of shock and are having to grasp the reality that is now in front of us. We are heartbroken. Our condolences for his family and loved ones and all the lives that he touched. We will never forget Kyle. And though he is gone too soon, his legacy is here to stay. Yorlet is a graduate of Belmont University, which was misidentified as Belmont College in an earlier version of the story. You think maybe the parents of these children need to be held accountable as well? I mean, this is totally crazy. I gotta believe that the singer probably didn't believe that children would do this to him. But he should have had a clue when he already handed over his wallet. If someone does something similar to you, where they demand your keys, give them to them. You can always get another car. You can't get another life. The link will be attached. You might want to repost this in your social media accounts. You might want to pass it along to your like-minded friends. Advise them to do the same.